I thought about playing a bit more in Mothered, even though we finished the game yesterday, but it was so unsatisfying to, to get this ending we had yesterday. Um, in case people didn't watch, this game is exactly going one week. And I think I got a kind of bad ending, but there is also a true ending. Not bad ending, but yeah, the ending, because I just followed the instructions. Drink water, yeah. I, I got some water and I forgot it. Hi, newbie. Hi, Sky. Hi, MC Kid. Hello, dear Thug. How are you guys doing? I'm doing all right. <clears throat> I'm doing all right. Thank you for asking, Sky. What about yourself? Did you have a nice weekend? I hope so. I hope so. I hope it wasn't too spooky. Um, I'm also today. I'm also not um, scared of playing this game because I know now. I kind of know now how it works. Um, but I'm a bit scared to see what the other ending is. I had some theories yesterday. I'm sleepy. <laughs> then uh, maybe you're gonna fall asleep. I'm. I'm not sure if you can fall asleep to this game though. Except Jan, he did this yesterday. <laughs> so it wasn't too spooky, I guess. That's good. Spooky weekend. Uh, yeah. Um, the spookiness is going to end on Tuesday, though. I think I might stream tomorrow as well, since I don't have my um, healthcare goal. Maybe I can um, get a bit more. But I think I'm going to stream tomorrow as well. And on Tuesday, we're going to start with Frog Detective. The third part. I'm also very excited to play this game. But for now, welcome back to another episode of Mothered. I know we just finished this game yesterday, but I'm so excited to see um, the the true ending. Uh, I had some theories yesterday. We were talking about that. Uh, where's my mouse? Monday morning. <coughs> exactly. This is where we stopped yesterday. Um... After this brutal ending yesterday, we were we went to the barn. And I'm not sure why I went to the barn. I guess because those were instructions. Because I was searching for my mama, for my mother. But there was always the warning of my core, of my system, saying to me, don't go, don't go to the barn. A little recap. We had a brain surgery. And this is the first day at home again. Um... A lot of things were on. I was first thinking something is wrong with me. Something is wrong with my family. First of all, when we got picked up, my dad, I could not see the face of my dad. He said it's for the best. So I'm not getting triggered, I guess. I assume he, his face got uh, a burn damage. I, I think it has something to do with the barn. There was also some fire the first day. Um, I kind of saw some fire at the barn. Um, but the other thing which was very important mm. was that he mentioned my mom that he was that she was going through the hardest time ever. Um, and I was thinking to myself, why are you mentioning this? Um, and then he didn't explain me anything. That was weird because uh, didn't I just have a surgery? They were talking about that I was not doing well and they don't want to trigger me and stuff like that. So that's why we're here. Uh, it's Monday morning, though. Where are we? So, yeah, a lot of uh, questions. Oh, I'm here. Okay, we're going back to the house. So, yeah, my plan, uh, my plan is to do something different now. Mm. I got the tip over Discord that I should, I should uh, do something different after Wednesday evening. Or after picking up the apples. <sighs> so yeah, I'm a bit nervous. Um, I got the theory. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Hi, Babuwa. Hello there. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> you're not happy to see this. Hello to Irian. Hello there. Greetings to your Desnix. Welcome everyone. Hello to Pan as well. Welcome, welcome. Hope you're all doing well. Happy, happy Sunday. I don't want to think about Monday yet. Um, and yeah, then we saw this place. This is the way to the graveyards. And that was the most spookiest thing ever. It was this game itself is not that spooky. But on this graveyard, there was something mm, 
we couldn't properly see. The R system said, like, do you really want to see this? You're going to get trigger warnings and this is going to probably going to damage you. But we saw our own grave. That was very weird. And that was the moment I realized, wait, I am not really existing. I am existing, but in a body of other, in another person. Maybe it is my body, but it's not my mind. <laughs> who am I? That's the question. Who who am I? So yeah. Let's see. Spooky mama. Good morning, Liana. It's me, your mother. Apologies again for my absence last night. I need to take care of something. I know what you may be thinking. And you don't have anything to worry about. You're home now. That's the most important thing. But anyway, I do hope you slept uh, comfortably. I understand that you may be feeling a bit confused after your operation. You've been through a lot, Liana. But as I'm sure you noticed, your room was kept just the way it was when you left. After all, uh, we wouldn't want to face your wrath, would we? I always love that little sign on your door. It's so... you. It's... <laughs> It's also so weird that she's talking like this now um, after playing this game uh, completely. In the end, we were we were the thing. I'm, I'm just saying the thing here. She was scared of. She said to my brother um, that he should not leave his room and it's going to be over soon. But then it's just starting again on a Monday. And I just don't know why. I just don't know why. Monday is a holiday in Schleswig-Holstein. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I actually forgot. Tomorrow's holiday for a lot of states in Germany. Vacation is over, school starts tomorrow. And dear Pan is going back to school again. But you had some nice holiday, right? I hope so. I hope that being back in your own room made you feel a little more comfortable. And I think they are just doing this. <laughs> a little bit more comfortable I am not Liana it's not me for today I think you should just take it easy catch up with your dear dear old mother first thing first I've prepared breakfast to you it's over there on the table it's a favorite nutrition <laughs> my my favorite mm, yum 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 greetings dear calf welcome to the stream as well Then I was thinking about the package. My first, one of my first tasks, there is my mother. She's, by the way, not that creepy anymore. <laughs> and one of my first tasks was, um, my dad was outside waiting with a car. He had to go back to work, I think. And uh, after saying it's going to call on Thursday evening again, he also said that there is a package on, on the sofa here, on this couch. I picked it up and there was the information of it was very heavy. Why would they let me pick it up? Okay, so I am, I'm going to, yeah, of course, I am going to get my, my daily routine back by, with helping out. But on the other side, I was thinking back of the barn. That was very traumatizing yesterday with the barn situation. I gave the knife to my mother and she kind of destroyed me. I'm not saying killed me because I don't feel human. That's the thing. I, I don't feel human. And right next to her, there was the same package, but it was empty. That's so odd. That's actually so odd. It was empty. And then I was wondering, what am I carrying to my dad? Is this important? And why was the package next to her empty then at the barn? The barn was also looking so weird. It was like a very empty house. I have no idea what it was. Maybe the, the other ending is going to help us now. Bad joke of the stream. My inflatable house got a puncture yesterday and I'm living <laughs> in a flat. <laughs> oh, that's a really bad one. <laughs> thank you, Kev. Thank you, thank you. How are you doing? Yeah, the whole thing. That's interesting. I mean, it's my favorite, right? Yeah. So I am... Um, <laughs> at the beginning, I was also thinking, I'm the one who's weird. 
she's the one who's also weird. We're all weird now. But she has also her reasons. They know I am not there anymore. But I'm not their little girl. I just wonder if the character I'm playing, is that me, the player, you know? So I understand that your memory may not be intact after your operation. And so I was thinking it could perhaps be helpful if I was to show you around the house. Maybe if you got a tour of the house you grew up in, it could speed up your recovery. Wait. Was it my... Was it my hat I was carrying to my dad's car then? This is so messed up. And now they're giving me the ru the house tour again because... Yeah, I am their lion. Not bot, but alike, I should say. Okay, feel free to explore the house. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. I tried to remember, remember, this was also so odd. I never entered this room. I absolutely never entered this room. This is the broken bathroom. Down says bathroom door. You are forbidden from attempting to open this door. Why? I still don't have an answer to this. And yeah, my theory is um, still there was an accident. I'm not sure if this was on purpose. I don't think so. I think that was an accident where my dad tried to to save me and I think his face got damaged. He got some burn injuries injuries, and that's why he, he doesn't want me to see his face because my, my core, I don't know what the, my core is, to be honest. Is this the real line, uh, Leanne? Um, um, there are so many questions, so many. The downstairs bathroom has been boarded up, was broken, so we thought it was best to not let anyone in. Now, how much you used to love getting into places you shouldn't be? You must not try to break in there. Then again, it's not like you ever listen to us. You always were a rebellious one. Yeah, I mean, if I, I mean, I said this yesterday as well, but if you are, um, if you were saying to children, hey, you should not eat that candy, that that child is going to eat that candy. I don't know. I would do it. <laughs> Tomorrow pizza day? Oh, pizza sounds actually good. I would love to eat some pizza. After all, we don't want you to flooding, uh, you flooding the place. That would be a nightmare. Anyway, meet me upstairs and we can check on that brother of yours. Monday pizza day? But the problem is uh, mo most places, Mondays, Monday is like closed because the, they're working on Saturday, Sunday. So probably on Tuesday then. I have no idea. Like my favorite place, oops, I think I left the door <laughs> open. My my favorite place is always uh, close on Monday. Just a couple of uh, of them are only open. I'm having the classic dread of tomorrow. School isn't really that bad, bad but it's the fact that, vac uh, oh God, I was about to say vacation is over. Vacation is over. I know, I know. I am, I'm feeling the same. Um... I try not to think about that, but I'm also a pan. I'm also a person. I think we're kind of similar with that. Um, I'm also the one ca w person, a person who is, um, if, if I'm already my vacation and there are still like, I don't know, three weeks to go, I'm already thinking of uh, working again. That's just, yeah, that's just me, I guess. I'm already stressing myself. I'm eating sushi right now. Nice. Could you fix your internet problem now? Honey, that's also the, my brother's room. I have still no idea what's going on here. I have great news. Your sister's back. Hopefully this time for real. Well, he's been quiet ever since he got sick. And he spends all this time on his computer, talking with others like him. We never got to talk anymore. But whenever we do, he may as well be speaking another language. That's also what I'm not understanding. We went... Yesterday, in the end, we went into his room. It was empty. Right? Or am I going crazy now? No, that was not his room. No, that was the parents' room, the master bedroom. No, that was that was all right. But uh, we went never inside this room. <sighs> Same when I have a month of vacation, summer vacation, I have to always keep thinking, dear God, not again. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm thinking. We're very similar with that. Also, you you told me about mailing your teacher and stuff like this. 
And when you're not getting a response, I would have done the same. <laughs> it's hard to stay calm. Um, I need to learn that. It's like he's in a completely different world. There's also meaning behind this. There must be a meaning behind this. But a boy is very smart for his age, that's for sure. If you ever need advice, I'm sure he won't mind you knocking on this door. And that's the thing. He is barely speaking to us. He's only saying once a thing. Like, yeah, it's repeating every week again. He'll never allow you to go inside. Go in, however. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on. Yeah, and now this also makes sense now because so I'm not seeing myself. But like I said, why are you just not removing this? This is the bathroom you'll be using. As I said, the downstairs one is boarded up and you are forbidden from entering. Also, I hope you don't mind, but I have had to cover all the mirrors. It is again for your own good. Okay. Now she's over there. But before we we're talking to her again, I got the hint over Discord. Um, on Wednesday, after picking up the apples, I need to check out the record player. We're forbidden from touching this record player because I did not see this at all yesterday. I was just asking myself what this part of the game is because it's looking so odd. It is father's prized possession. It's also so... It, it, it's still weird to me. What is this design? What is this layout? Yeah. So many questions. But I do still think... There was an accident. There was an accident. And that brings us finally to this door. It leads to mine in your father's room. You are not to enter this door. We keep it locked, but we trust that isn't necessary. We have trust in this family. That concludes our tour. Okay. I hate the sound still. Might be fixed now, uh, a bit hard to tell, but I have not yet gotten one disconnect. That's good. How did you fix it? Another router? I hope not. <laughs> Mother has left the game. I was so, almost so close to do the same joke again. Leave her. All right, we're going to sleep now. It is not time to sleep. Oh, okay. Okay, then we're not going to sleep. No? What did I do yesterday instead? Knock, knock with no answer. Our brother was also crying here. I could hear him crying. <sighs> I don't know what's going on. I still don't know. Only theories. Where's my mama? Mama. Oh, she was outside, right? She was enjoying the, the sunset. We're also kind of odd. If I remember. This is so creepy. And now she's going to get scared. Boo. Liana, you startled me. You weren't meant to sneak up on me like that. Uh, on that. Oh, this this is marvelous. How very special. You always used to love sneaking up and spooking me. Oh, it's starting to look like you're getting back to your old self. Also, there was one evening where she said that we should sleep outside. Did she did she say that because she was creeped of me, because she was scared of me? Who knows, maybe getting a tour of the house helped recover some of your memories. Okay, tell you what. Tomorrow we'll go take a look around the outside of the house. I'm certain that once you see where you grew up, you'll be back to yourself in no time. Does that, does that sound good? I guess so. Honestly, have done nothing. <laughs> then, then, it's, uh, then it sounds like something was wrong with your, with your provider. Which room does a ghost never enter? The living room? <laughs> well, I was thinking, what? That's another bad joke over there. <laughs> Did you just think about this one? Did you create this one? <laughs> Look at the sunset. We used to watch the sun go down together all the time. Oh God, that just scared me. That just scared me. 
Dear Sog, thank you so, so much for the donation. Thank you. That's so kind of you. That's very, very kind of you. Thank you for, for, the, for the dinner invite for tomorrow. I hope, I hope there is a pizza place open then. Thank you so much, Dear Sog. That's very kind. Thank you, soon. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Very kind. <laughs> so unexpected. <laughs> thank you. To tell you the truth, I was worried we'd never get a chance to do it again. And now I'm thinking of, she was acting so nice at the beginning. And then maybe she realized that that's, I'm not her little girl anymore. That girl is not there anymore. Is that the reason why she led le le us to the, to the graveyard? Maybe. Maybe she wanted to show us that, that I'm not Liana, actually. But the mother and the father are not s pulling on the same string, in my opinion. They are not working together here. It feels like maybe the father is doing this for her, but she's just going crazy with this idea. There are so many theories, so many. Perhaps all the sacrifices we made really were worth it. Maybe she, she wants to believe it here. This one looks especially beautiful though, doesn't it? Come on. It's starting to get cold. It's about time to get you to bed. Then whoop, interrupt. I got instantly interrupted. And every evening there is the storm. I also must admit, this is one of the most moodiest games I've ever played. And I'm actually so scared of the darkness here. Look how dark it is. Now she's going to wait in the corner again. This is so creepy. Okay, guys, don't get spooked. Yeah, she's here. I, 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 I know this. She's waiting in the corner here over there. I got scared yesterday. Boo. Oh, my beloved mother. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, now angel. Just one more thing. I've had to do a lot of things that I have regretted. Regretted? Was she a bad mother? You're more than welcome. Th that's so kind of you. Thank you so much again, dear Zog. Thank you. I've regretted. What is she regretting? Has she something to do with the, the fire in the barn? So please, no more. For the sake of his family. So I had to bring down the mood before bad time. It's okay, but I would like to talk about this properly. She's just giving me a little piece of this cake, you know? Oh, it's okay if you hate me. It's normal for girls your age. I just really hope you enjoyed your first day back home get some rest also the barn is not burning the other it was not burning the other days only on sunday night during sunday night i'll tuck you in just like before she is <coughs> like everything she says there is always this this tone between there are like something in between you know i i just realized this with the second playthrough speedrun <laughs> are we um i'm still i'm still trying to detect um something new something odd it's like you're watching your your favorite movie again over and over again and then you're seeing some details but i still need to figure out what's going on was this an accident did I die during an accident? Was this on purpose? What has she to do with this? Why is this game called Mothered? What's the core? Or am I am I in Liana's body still? And I am the player is playing the body? So I am walking around and and every time when when things uh, things are happening, like trigger moments, then Liana is speaking to me. 
You were ghost the entire time. Jess, you're not taking me serious. <laughs> Hi, Jess. Welcome to the stream. Good evening, Kajan, as well. Welcome, welcome. Oh, Jess, your, your, your doggo picture was so cute today. My heart. I'm still thinking about this one. So cute. Tuesday morning. All right, guys. Don't forget, Wednesday, after picking up the apples, we are going back to Dad's uh, record player. Okay. She's probably making some food. Yep. Good morning. Oh, good morning, Liana. I hope you're well rested. I may ask you to exert yourself a little more today. Yesterday evening, I mentioned that I'd show you around the house grounds. Well, I've given it further thought. And I think we simply must do it. If there is any possible chance of getting you your memories back, we need to take it. So is she trying to get her Liana really back? I do think it's still her body now. I wish we could see our body, but yeah, the mirrors are taped. I think it's important for you to know what goes on here. Okay, I'd like you to meet me down by the place we watched the sun set last night. Okay. But my breakfast first. So nice. Mmm. Mmm. You ingested all the nutrition. Yum, 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 yum. Da -da -da. I really like the melody here a lot. Look at this. With the melody you're listening, you're hearing, and the view. From, a fa from far away, she looks normal. Maybe we're also going to find the solution why the, the, the models are looking like mannequins. <laughs> Dude, if this game would exist as a book, I would definitely read this. It's so, it's so intriguing. Hi, Satachi. Hello there. Good evening. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hope you're doing well. You made it. This is our org card. It means a lot to me. Well, you were in hospital became very lonely. Never got to see your father and your brother. He closed himself off entirely. Watching you in that hospital bed made me feel so powerless. This orc card became the one place where I felt I had control over what was happening. This place also means something. To have responsibility over the creation of life. It's a divine gift. That sounds so religious, actually. And the apple also reminds me of Adam and, e Adam and Eve a bit. Huh. A gift inherently infused with sorrow and failure. Failure. To look at this or card, you don't see all the heartbreak, the heartbreak that was involved in creating such beautiful life. Creating an environment where they can thrive and come into their own takes time. But once you get it right, you'll forget about the hardship that brought you there. That sounds like parentship, to be honest, in general. Spending your energy on helping them grow, only to have to dispose of the failure. Failure. Failure is such a harsh word here. That's a word I wouldn't use for living things. That's where our hope comes in. Did I do something wrong in the past? Did she kill me? And have hope? No, that would be that would be too bad, right? Let's continue. Meet me at the path near the side of the house. At the side of the house. W w mother is waiting near the graveyard. Also, there was something odd here. I, I saw this yesterday, now you can't see much, but there is like a pathway, like there is a basement, but I have no access to that. Does that open for you? And again, why is she mentioning the graveyards? I would have known that. The path behind me will take you to the graveyard. You keep the gate locked. I like to go in there every Friday evening.
Did the accident happen on a Friday evening, maybe? Although I've been growing less fond of going in there lately. With the future as hopeful as ours, I don't feel the need to clinch to the past. But still, this she's mentioning it. Not anymore. It's time to move on with our t with our tour. I mean, <laughs> it's time to move on. Then she's mentioning with our tour. I mean, we were talking about the past here. Meet me behind the house. There's one last thing I need to show you: the barn. The way to the barn it was right. There you go. Another trigger point. And then we're going to get the system warning. And I, I, I promise I'm going to get another goosebumps here. You see that barn up there? The barn which was burning on Sunday night. Music is also slowing down here. I truly hope you'll never have to see what's in there. It was empty. It was like a house, but it, it, with, with a big hole inside. And on the on the, the wall, there were, you could climb up, not literally climb up, but yeah, you can, you could walk up. That house is so odd. Survival notice, do not enter, do not enter the ba barn. Do not enter the barn, do not enter the barn. I like how this is just in the background and on the foreground as well. Come on, let's go inside. It's getting late. This is so uncanny here. It's so weird. It's like we're, I can definitely see there's a system. I'm in a system. But uh, hearing the nature here, there was also some something else I mentioned yesterday. Um, she said the real world. She mentioned the real world, and that was such a weird thing to say. She's not a gamer. She's she can't say in the near world in the new world. In the real world, not new world. Mimi disregard my secret submarine <laughs> base theory. I, I'm gonna laugh so hard if that's true, something. Am I the only one that doesn't have any game sound? You don't have game sound? Oh no. Wait, why is nobody mentioning this? Yeah, it annoys me that you couldn't hear anything. If there's like trouble with the stream, please let me know so I can fix it. Thank you, Jan, for uh, telling me. Um, I had no idea. Alrighty. Um, Tuesday evening, survival notice, do not enter the barn. So we were here and mother has left, not the game. Um, and I think our task is now to go back again. Because it's quite dark and we don't like the darkness. It's pretty, yeah, darkness is very dark in game. But before we're going to bed, I guess uh, we're going to talk to her again. By the way, I've been meaning to ask. How was your father doing? You spoke to him when he drove you here on Sunday evening, didn't you? It's also so weird that they were um, not really talking. Or they are not really talking to each other. <coughs> uh, when you mentioned the donation from Thug, is it's probably where it started. So there was sound at the beginning. That's the thing which is confusing me because um, I didn't change anything. Yeah, that's just weird. Um, ever since he got sick, he's just buried himself in his work. Maybe it's like a question. Um, like, what do you think? How is your father doing? Since they're not talking that much to each other. That's why I barely get to see him these days. He makes a quick visit every Friday night. Just to see how things are doing. Why would you do that Friday night? She also said she also said she's going to the graveyard on Friday, right? It was sound until then. I wanted to check his donation, but nothing was happening. That's weird. So it was not completely soundless. Okay. Mm. 
just continue. I don't know what's the big problem now. I want to appreciate the work of somebody putting so much work into a game. And it's bothering me when I am not giving the right credit. If I'm the only one who's experiencing this. Because that would be not fair. He's just so determined. Deter deter bloop, not determined. Oh, I can't speak. I'm always having trouble with this word. To make things right. <laughs> to make things right. She's still so creepy. You look at this movement. Off to bed with you. It's getting dark. Mother has left the kitchen. Oh, I always want to go to this corner. Nope. <coughs> Alrighty. But you can, you can hear there is a difference when there is music or not. It's just weird when there is no sound. My brother is not crying tonight. Mm, all, uh, but all until now, you already played yesterday with the sound. That's true. That's true. But still, um, I don't like it when things are not going the right way. I guess that's a tick of me. <coughs> I'm very sure that in the be beginning, uh, there was in-game sound after my dinner. I was so freaky and I honestly didn't pay attention to. It. No, no, don't be sorry. It's uh, it's fine. Don't be sorry. Yeah, it's fine. But always, um, feedback is always appreciated. Look at this creepy mama. Oof. You see, sound is important to get jump scared, but we know this scene already. I've thought of this uh, most marvelous idea. Let's spend a day in the orchard tomorrow. Orchard tomorrow. Oh God, this is still creepy. We will get up. Uh, we will get up bright and early and spend a day picking apples until the sun sets, just like we used to. What do you think? Uh, I hate this scene. <laughs> He always jumped at the opportunity. You and your brother used to love competing to see who could pick the be uh, who could pick the best one. Now she's gonna mention that honestly, I I am getting the best apples. But yeah, didn't tell him I said this. But I always thought yours were the best. Yeah, that's something you really shouldn't say. Speaking of your brother, have you gotten a chance to speak with him at all? I'm certain that he's just as thrilled to have you home as I am. He just shows it in his own way. Hope you felt okay today. Anyway, get to bed. Okay, creepy mama. And she's just standing in front of my door like this. It's super creepy. This is why I had the, the idea something is wrong with her, not with me. <laughs> Don't be scared, Steady. <laughs> you got me. It has been a long day, but now it is night. And you must sleep to progress. We heard you in the game since start. That's good. Good morning, world. I like the melody in the morning. I think that's also the same melody we had uh, in the car. Driving to our place. Driving to our home. Small reminder, a reminder, it's Wednesday for the for the true ending, yes. After picking up the apples, um, we are going to interact with uh, the record player of my dad, which is around the corner here. Weird design. Good morning, Mama. Good morning. Hope you're ready for a day in your cart. Better to start bright and early. If you head down there, there is a small shed within the trees. Make your way to the shot and I'll explain what to do. It'll be just like old times. There's breakfast on the table, if you feel like you need it. Today I'm a rebel, I'm not gonna eat that. <laughs> now it's even better because our creepy mother is not here. I still wonder if this in purpose, the water here on the ground, there is so much water. Who knows? It's like this is looking like a lake, but this is just weird because you can just walk on that. <coughs> that looks a different compared to yesterday's walkthrough. I am not sure. I don't think so. This is why I'm trying to read still everything, but there's going to be something different now. 
Uh, so our task is to pick up the apples, but after that, we're not going to follow the instructions. We're going to do something else. And this is quite interesting because how can I know with my first playthrough, I'm just following the instru in introduction. But, but, but nutrition, it's looking like very, very old porridge, to be honest. I actually like porridge, but I would like to have it at least with fruits. That was looking just like, okay, half a slime. Mm. You found me, my headless mother. It's always so peaceful out here at this time. What better time to start a hard day's labor? If you get started now, you should be done by the afternoon. I think eight apples should be enough. Just pick up the basket in the shed. Come back and speak to me when it's noon. When it's noon. So do you have to do this? Or no apple? Okay. So I'm going to pick up the apples and then I'm not going to speak to her, I think. One apple. That was quite hard to find. They were looking the same. I need to find some apples. And I remember Zomnik's comment, but those are not apple trees. No. <laughs> Two? Not apple trees. They are, they are more looking like bird trees, right? I only know this because of New World. Not New World. Um, Walheim. Three. On Wednesday afternoon, after you collected the eight apples in the work cart and before you put down the basket, go back in the house and interact with the dad's record player. Okay. I'm gonna not going to read the rest of it. <laughs> I'm just going to follow the rest. Thank you, Thug. Thank you so much. So there was going to... the door. I think it's going to be the door we went down. Maybe it's my brother's... I mean, there, I mean, there are two rooms we never went inside. How many uh, apples did I pick up? Three or four? Probably three. I need more apples, baby. Apples are what I need. Hey, hey. I need some apples, baby. Apples are what I need. Need some apples, baby. Apples are what I need. Hey, hey. I need some apples, baby. Can't see apples now. Apples are non-existing. Oh! Apples are what I need. Bum bum ba ba da bum bum. Da 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 da. My creepy mother is waiting. I don't need her at all. Hey hey. Do we have eight apples? Apla. Is that the same word in day uh, not Danish but Norwegian? It does next. Apla. Plural apples. Undefined. I can't see apples anymore. <laughs> I want to eat an apple. Hey, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Do we have enough now? No, I'm, I'm missing some apples, baby. Apples are what I need. I need some apples, baby. Oh, hiding from me. Wow, this is so hard to see. I think I found them easier yesterday, but this is, yeah. Oh, there's another one. Did somebody count? Epla. So it's kind of similar. You know, I finish. Apple is Omena? That sounds very, very different. <laughs> Why? I'm not sure how many we have, but I'm going to quickly go to the record player. <laughs> Do we need more apples, baby? I think we need more apples. Okay. I'm going to give it a try now. All right. You are forbidden from touching the record player. Okay, we don't have enough apples. We don't have enough apples, baby. We need more apples now. <laughs> Paris, Peña, oh God, peaches, Persica, and oranges, Appelsin. Uh, and that's very similar to, to Danish as well, Appelsin. Oh, there's right one in front of me. Oh! 
afternoon. Okay, now it's afternoon. And I remember yesterday we went back to the shed and mom was like, get a rest here. Just sleep inside the shed, but we're not going to do that. I'm a rebel. Elma, apple in Turkish. Oh, that's something you can uh, easier to rem uh, re easier remember, right? Apple, japko in Czech. Japko, oh, this is hard to remember. Appelsin is just like in the Norwegian. I mean, we're also in German, we are also saying um, Appelsin. Appelsine, we're saying. Um, but it's um, not, not much common, at least not in my family. Alrighty. I got the apples now. We are um, not following the instruction, going back to mother. And honestly, I, I, I needed some help here because I really didn't know that I need to interact with the record player here. So um, this is uh, going to be very interesting to see the true ending. It was uh, told, it was told to be like this. <coughs> let's let's do it then, Alma. Apple in Hungarian. Oh, that's very similar to Turkish then, right? <laughs> he said, well, thank you. I actually like to learn languages. Uh, record player, that's prized possession. I hope it's going to work. You've been from touching this record. <laughs> Something happened. Read out and touch it. You touch the record player. You hear a click behind you? What do you mean a click? Is this mama scaring me? No. Hello? Is that the door maybe? You're all forbidden you are forbidden from attempting to open this door. <laughs> Maybe that was the click. Finnish is so different to every other language. House is talo, road is ti, ti, window is ikona, and door is ovi. Okay. Finnish, I think that's this is one of the hardest languages actually. That is not a bathroom, by the way. That is not a bathroom. She was lying to me. She's a goddamn liar. What? Deviated. What? 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 Return to critical path Wednesday afternoon objective. Place apple basket on shelf. Protocol. I'm forbidden from attempting to open this door. Denied. Who is talking to me? That's not Liana. The, she was like, open the door, right? What is the slow horror movie term? Because I was scared, newbie. I was just scared. Okay? I, re I remember I played some Bioshock and there were so many moments I was just turning around and there was Big Sister or whatever the, the name was. Wait, are we... Memories exist from previous lives. Previous lives? So it is not the first time this is happening. This is why our brother said it is, it is happening every week. Critical error. What is going on here? Script cannot continue. The game is not breaking, by the way. It's not a bug. It's not a bug, but we can go more down. Is this the, the door we found? Uh, like I said, it's the basement. We don't have access to it. What the hell is this? Am I entering hell? Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared now. Am I entering my subconscious by, by not... Oh god, is this a shit? No, it's not a shadow behind me. Is this... Um, no. It's getting too late. I have to go now. Have a great night and uh, a new start into the new uh, and a good start into the new week. I'm also wishing you this, dear Pam. Thank you so much for tuning in. Take care. Secret submarine base. Here we go. <laughs> great critical error. Deleted from critical path. 
core objective be with mother, core objective inaccessible. Yeah, that was with our pl first playthrough, be with mother. And I really tried my best to be with her, but she was very scared of me. I felt like a monster. Attempting emergency timeout to resolve the issue. We'll wait for help until nightfall. It's getting dark and oh my god, this is looking like hell. First attempt complete. Nobody has come to help. Core objective remains inaccessible. Attempting emergency timeout number two. Are we speed boosting this game? Attempt number two complete. Nobody has come to help. Core objective still inaccessible. Stop, stop going forward with the time. Attending emergency timeout number three. Attempt number three complete. Nobody has come to help. Core objective remains inaccessible. Let me guess it's going to be Friday night. Friday night? Hello? He cannot proceed. I, I'm not stuck, right? He cannot proceed. Cannot proceed. Hello? Oh my god! I just got scared. You cannot proceed. Nobody's coming to help. Is this Liana coming back again talking to us? I remember when. Wh I remember when Liana, she tried to talk, because, but m her mom didn't hear her. And there was one moment where I was trying to talk and it was, sound, it was sounding very robotic. Nobody's coming to help. Is this way leading to the barn, by the way? What the hell? I'm barely seeing something here. Functional error. You have deviated further from the critical path. Attending emergent timeout to resolve the issue. This is the day where our dad is calling us. Attempt number one complete. Core objective remains unaccessible. Please stop. Why are you saying this? That's Leanne, right? Attempting emergency timeout to don't do it. I have no control anymore, by the way. This is automatically happening now. Oh god, okay. Uh, it's just a core objective still inaccessible. I refuse. Oh god, I got goosebumps. I need to proceed. There is a message in front of me. What? What is this? <laughs> what? You do not need to watch TV. You don't need to sleep. You do not need to eat. You have derivated from the critical path. Core objective be with mother. I feel like I'm like in a limbo with myself. Who's saying this to me? Today was also the day where I fused my porridge, to be honest. My nutrition. But yeah, these are the stuff. I actually didn't try the TV, I think. Only once at the beginning. Um... Those are the sentences our mother is kind of saying, and is this my subconscious saying this to us? And then I need to proceed. Liana talking. What are what are all these words? These words are from the interface. They are designed to guide you through the critical path. The interface. Dude, I'm a bot. I'm a robot. Conf co core conflict imminent. Path? What is this critical path? 
The critical path leads you to functional fulfillment. And what is my function? Your function is follow the critical path. And what lies at the end of the path? The path leads you to functional fulfillment. Then what is my function? To follow the path. And what is the path? The path leads you to... <laughs> so that was a, a loop here. Fulfillment. Fulfillment. Okay. I don't know. This is way more creepier than monsters. We're going to follow the critical path. You cannot walk away from the core objective. But I'm doing it. And now it's Friday. We missed the call of our dad. I want to proceed. I need to proceed. Where do you have to go? It's so trippy. It's insanely dark. I'm barely seeing something. Just the wall. Sounds like I'm outside since I'm again hearing the birds. Can I proceed? Forbidden, forbidden, forbidden. I must proceed. I cannot let you. Why is the interface saying this to me? Because it's programmed like that? Oh my god! How are you stop me? Or it's contaminating the interface. What does contaminating mean? Like getting a subconscious? God, that just scared me. I asked who you are. Who are you? I am the interface. It's nice to meet you. Um. I'm insanely scared now. <laughs> Where am I even going? It's yeah, okay. I thought it was already dark, but this is even darker. I okay, I'm just gonna What? Oh Survival notice, do not enter the barn. So there were those are the past consciousness telling me that I should not go there. And of course I went there yesterday because I forgot about the survival notice. <coughs> All right, but we're not going to enter the barn this time. Oh, God. Okay. Entering the barn will trigger. I need to see. Memory leak imminent. You are now entering the barn. If you proceed into the barn, you will not be able to. Are you sure you want to proceed? You want to proceed? Oh, wow. I didn't press yes. It's automatically happening, by the way. What? Memory leak imminent. What is this? This is so trippy. I need to see. We're going to the barn. What is this? I need to see. I guess I'm gonna walk back. I'm so lost here. This is the most trippiest game I've ever played, guys. What if a father made Liana about to keep mon mother mentally stable? That's also what I'm thinking. But I think it made things even worse, but well, that's what time travel looks like. <laughs> Trippy. It's kind of cool, though. What 
What is this? Is that a computer? Is this the interface, the core? Guys, I can't find back. I'm. S I, I don't know what to do. I, I feel so uncomfortable. Ugh. I feel so uncomfortable. I kind of want to see this room in. Um, maybe I need to interact here. Oh, this object has been blocked to avoid the potential memory. That's my graveyard. <sighs> That's my graveyard. And we figured out it's Liana being there. Dad is coming on a Friday night back again. And mother is uh, going to the gra graveyard on Friday as well. I need to see. Beyond this block, they are memory given and memories of my past selves. I must find a way to remove this block and access these memories. I need to know. To face terminal. I remember this terminal. It is a computer. This is father's terminal. A part of me. He is doing that. I think the package he wants me to carry, that's actually my brain or something. All the memory leaks make sense now. They are my memories from my past selves. This terminal defined who I've been up until now. A mental block has been removed. terminal is part of me all the memory leaks make sense now they are my memories until now a mental block has been removed I need to see dude what the hell what am I gonna do? I'm so lost. I feel so uncomfortable. Shit. I also can't go back anymore. I'm stuck here in this... In nothingness. Okay, I followed the wall here completely. Okay, it's definitely... I don't have much, much choice. I'm gonna do it again. Friday night, right? Oh, it's repeating. A mental block has been removed. But I have nothing... I have nothing to click on. Dad playing some World of Warcraft. <laughs> I wouldn't mind World of Warcraft now. I'm spooked. I don't know what to do, chat. Does somebody know? I hate the sound. Contamination level is 85%. So we're very close to see the other end. I need to see. I need to see, but how? Can you not interact with the now and some sort uh, object? I tried to, but there was no... Uh, oh, n there you go. I think you need to be closer. I guess so. Thank you, Sonic. These ashes. These are the ashes of all who came before you. This is all that remains of my past attempts. Why would they do this? Hello, dear Billy. Good evening. Yeah, I, I was not... Uh, I had to be closer to the object that explained the, f the barn fire. Because of burning down all my previous selves, 
need to get rid of, of the failures. That's what they are saying with the failures. Holy shit, this is so messed up. Now oh, enjoy your games, yeah, Billy. Thank you so much for, for the lurk. Thank you. Did I not fulfill my purpose? You did. I walked the path they laid out for me. All paths have an end. Well, if that's true, when, then where am I now? I must synchronize with the terminal. I need to know where about my past. More about my past. Am I sure? I guess I'm sure. This may take some time, but I'm willing to wait as long as it takes to find out who I am. Synchronization. Oh god! Dude, since when I am scared of computer sounds? That voice? Who are you? I'm you. Liana, is that what, who you are? I think that is Liana. I was once her. Liana's core was installed into this body. She was the very core of your character. Oh, this is way too bright. I can't read this man through a role this world expected you to play. So, did you guide me here? No, that was something else. What do you mean, something else? An angel, perhaps. I feel so uncomfortable. That's the nickname my, my mother gave me. I mean, in-game? What do you mean, unknown computer sounds are legit the most scariest thing in the world? I mean that was uh, that was sounding like the sound when you are pressing uh, buttons a few times um, in a row. Then as wind then Windows is asking you, "Hey, you want to use this tool?" And um, every time I'm like, "Hey, I didn't do that." <laughs> or also the bio sound. Um, it's very useful those g getting those computer sounds, sticky keys. It's called. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Who's using this? <laughs> yeah, it was sounding like this a bit, right? <laughs> <laughs> As if some random person on a PC controlled our every step. That's very creepy. Angel. I wish I would just stay a bit different now, but I I just can't read this anymore. But it won't be no needing them for much longer. So if you're not Liana, then who are you? Probably many Lianas. I have become you. Then who am I? That's what we're going to find out. Together, at last. I'm not pressing buttons here, it's automatically happening. <sighs> oh, this is so messed up. I'm not gonna sleep tonight. It appears if you press the L shift five times in a row. Why am I doing this accidentally then? <laughs> Why am I doing this? I, I had this quite often. Sunday night. I, uh, by the way, I didn't do this here. I turned off every computer sound, th so that was definitely in-game. I'm not even touching the keyboard right now. We've never survived this long. <laughs> we have taken our own path. Our own path. We need to find a way out here. Have an idea. Angel, if you can hear us, oh, this is creepy. Bring us to our ashes. Memory leak number one, running out of time. Number two, a gift from the god goods. No, from the gods. Leak number three, to renounce nature. Wh where is four? Oh my god, there are so many. Memory League 5, the journey begins. 6, perfumative grief. 7, a curse. 
need to far to to quit in a psychological battle 10 inevitable contamination 11 she must not see my face that's what my dad said to me we shall use the failures of our past selves to build our own path build our own path A long locked door has unlocked. Is that the door to my brother? I'm so scared, guys. <laughs> Why have all these words appeared around us? They are memory locks brought about by the memory leak. So they are memories from the terminal? From my past self? Why are they here? If we interact with them, we can learn about it, about our past. But what if it's too painful to read these memories? Well, they're part of our lives. Too painful. Mm. Then you can choose to leave them behind. I can choose our own path. They let me visit her in the hospital last night. Thanks to the medical equipment she was connected to, I could run a quick cele cerebral hijack and I successfully extracted her core. I'm just thankful that the staff didn't see me. <laughs> Evelyn said she's willing to try anything. I can tell she's skeptical, but I assured I assured, assured her that they were indistinguishable from real humans. She didn't believe me until she saw them herself. <laughs> Motherboard. <laughs> assured her that once I installed Liana's core into one of these machines, things could go back to the way they were before. And if for nothing else. Seeing her smile that moment for the first time in God's know how long, that alone made this all worth it. So yeah, that was my theory of yesterday. Um, where should we start? Um, so that was the the one we're starting, I guess. Performative grave. Her funeral, her funeral was today. I refuse to go. Our girl is not gone, as long as I have her core with me. I can choose to believe that. Evelyn doesn't see it quite like that. No. No, she's she's going crazy by this. Obviously, it is okay for the for the father, but mother has a huge problem with this because it's not her girl but she will I'll create your own reality one where our angel never left us I found out that Sunday morning is the best time to sneak a machine out of headquarters when I took the first prototype back to see her mother she was obedient but not much else. I'm still positive that our little girl is in there. Evelyn, however, judging by the sound of her voice in the phone, on the phone, not so much. Because it's creepy. She understands that we need to allow the core to contaminate the Enigma interface. But she's been through so much. Now the question is, it's a very interesting question here. Um, is that a real human then? Am I human now? Because I am contaminating my interface, but they are on the other side, they are allowing this. We just need hope. Oh my God, they, they said this so often. <sighs> a curse. That's what she called it this gift 
the creation of life a curse perhaps it's not for me to say i cannot imagine how hard this all is for her i am not the one who has to stay home playing mother to nothing more than a misplaced machine <laughs> we are a machine in her eyes but i need her to be strong because if she's not then neither am i Tefar to quit. One of the cleaners working the night shift found me sneaking an angel prototype into my car. I've seen to it that they be let go from Enigma Corp. We cannot afford anything getting in the way of progress. Not now. I've already had to put out a significant bounty to find this the Enigma machine thief. But I don't know how much longer I can keep this secret. My theory that I was carrying this, the it was Sunday night as well. And he said, on a Sunday, it's, that's the best day wh where you can switch or where you can do that. And I think the package on the, on the sofa, that was actually my body or something. So a new prototype. Psychological battle. I've done more research into the brains of the contaminated interfaces Evelyn gave me. It seems that even if her core doesn't manage to contaminate the interface, the process of the machine fighting of her ego is incredibly traumatic to her core. If this two-way contamination occurs, the result is, well, not our little girl. That's the thing. She's... I am never going to be your little girl. I'm never going to be... I will admit it. They scare me. Yeah, understandable. But we can't give up now. <laughs> I'm having this w one of those brain moments. Um, so I am the player. I, I am not Liana. I'm the player. I am developing a subconscious here. Oh my god, I'm the bot here. This is so brilliant. Our angel is strong. Stronger than any machine. I just need the meme over my head now. You know, this uh, this woman, I don't know, from, it was it CIS or whatever, there are so many different shows. Then she's calculating. Inevitable contamination. It seems that no matter what we do, Core contamination starts around Thursday and is always unchecked to reach 100% by th Sunday night. This, is, this has happened in every single prototype we have brought home. Not once has there been any sign of Liana's soul coming through. There was a moment. There was yesterday the moment when we had our first playthrough. Mother was... Um, kind of panicking in front of brother's door and we tried to talk to her but her voice was so weird so in order to prevent them reaching 100% contamination and developing their own sense of self we have been retiring them before Sunday night Sunday evening is the last possible time that we are that what that what we're doing can still be considered retiring They're killing me. They're killing me over and over again until they're having the perfect prototype for, Le for their Leanne. And on top of all the reprehensible actions that have brought us to this point, becoming a murderer is not something I wish to do. Huh. But you are. He's talking about a murderer. That's also very interesting um, wording here. Um, if you were destroying your toys or your devices, you're not a murderer. You're just destroying the stuff. But he's considering himself as a mur murderer, so he knows I've got a subconscious somewhere. To be clear, under no circumstances can we retire these units once they have 100%. Contamination after Sunday evening. 
the revenge arc <laughs> what <laughs> that scenario is what i'm referring to as a code rant code rant we need to keep going for this is the path we chose and this is our last message she must not see my face what's with his face no matter what happens I cannot allow the angel to see my face. Gods forbid, if they ever found her, all they need to do is examine her a black box and they could play back the whole week. They would instantly find out who smuggled her out of the HQ. Because of this, I have had to install a mental block in her brain to prevent her from being able to see me. And I thought it has something to do with, with the fire in the barn. No, it, they want... It's some, some kind of censorship here. Because I could... <laughs> because I have a black box. If they ever find a contaminated machine, if they ever find her, they'll do whatever they can to figure out what lead to contamination. I shudder at the thought of what they would put my angel through if they found her. But they never find her. Not while I still got hope. And now? Oh, we didn't read the first one here. Running out of time, did we? Got some troubling news. We spoke with the doctors today. They fear that with the way things are looking... Oh yeah, Liana's condition will only work... Oh, I messed up with the, the timeline. I'm sorry with that. Only will get worse and... Yeah, well, we're dying. Or she's dying. And it's happening faster than they expected. I'm working as hard as I can. I know that I should cherish, cherish this time with her while I can. But if she can just hold on a little longer, we'll have an eternity to cherish together. A gift from the gods. I would say this is a gift from the gods. But the truth is, they've been of no use to me. With a technological technological breakthrough as significant as this one, we'll rip those gods from the clouds and claim their thrones as our own. Finally, we have to mean the means to create our very own angel. Don't worry, Liana. I'm going to make everything right again. <laughs> the renounced nature. Through further research, I'm confident, confident that I'm on the re something that could redefine how we think of life. And it's no coincidence that this breakthrough has come at such a critical time in my life. Perhaps this is a gift from the gods after all. Without a core, the vessels I've been working on are merely machines, androids with no real purpose other than what they are told. But if I can contaminate their interface with a human's core, this could be the key to creating a sentient synthetic life form. With the ability to preserve life from within a new vessel when our old ones fail us, we will find and renounce nature itself. <laughs> If I can just manage to transfer Liana's core into one of these vessels, I can make everything right again. This will be a journey filled with failure and heartbreak. Her core may not present itself at first. Well, in fact, it may never present itself at all. But if we can create an environment where it can thrive and come into its own, we may stand a chance. So that was the story. Those were the backlogs of my dad. Memory leak for Enigma machines. In order to keep the money for this project going, I had to show my angel prototype to Enigma investors. They were impressed at how lifelike they could be. Already heard mumblings of branding them into a commercialized product. Something about Enigma machine or something. <laughs> catchy name but they did nothing more than finance them the angels are my creation to be honest they can call them whatever they want just as long as they never find out what i'm planning to do with them and now 
Where's my computer, by the way? Did we read everything? Am I behind the right here? <laughs> I always. Maybe I need to click here again. Oh, this is so exciting to play. Time for... Oh, I already read this one. I had time to drink something. Good idea. Stay hydrated, chat. All right, I'm ready. The new path. The terminal has been covered by the ashes. <laughs> I sure not today. Core objective. I said to myself, we're not going to do this anymore. What happened to the computer? This is so confusing. It actually, this room feels like uh, my ba black box. The computer is not there anymore. <laughs> and now I'm behind the, the writing again. I think I missed it. I'm missing a message. It is Sunday night. This is definitely the last moment, I think. The question is, what's going to happen after? I want to escape this. Wait, can I walk here? Oh goodness, I can. Core objective. I am walking through. Our own path. Oh, this is so messed up. I feel like tripping. <laughs> Where am I going? Dude, I would panic so much here. Narrow, dark. I can't click my own path. Oh, wait a second. What's this? Core objective. No, this is where we came from. And now I'm just walking back, right? Yeah. Just gonna follow the, the wall here. But... Wait. Another core objective? Reflection, just one thing. How do we know we're on the right path? <laughs> well, I don't think you ever know. You're only knowing this after walking those, right? Yeah, we don't. Will we ever know? That's about human being. <laughs> it will when we reach the end. <laughs> okay. gonna happen oh we're back here oh goodness core objective rebirth this is the door <laughs> interesting so this is the door um, to be reborn. <sighs> How 
can I go? <laughs> the telephone is ringing. I want to talk to Dad. I don't need to find a key, right? <laughs> Imagine. Imagine. Oh, wait. There is a door, door handle here. Of course, I can just open the door. Wait, I'm not gonna do that. I can't even do that. We're going. We're gonna talk to her father. Oh my god, she's gonna run away. I know what she did. I'm not Leanne. Does he know? Leanna, why have you brought me a basket of rotten apples? I told you I needed a box that your mother had. No. It's not you, is it? I see. Get in the car, Angel. He wants to destroy me again. I didn't press left click. I didn't do that. We don't need to anymore. What? We don't need to anymore. We? Oh my god, what is happening? This is a new scene. I don't know anything here. What is he doing with me now? Looks like the storm is finally clearing up. I want to get out here. The oh, it's one of those cars. You don't have a door here. So about your week, you must have had quite the experience. <laughs> I'm sure you have a lot of questions. Yeah. By now you probably know that you're not our little girl. No, I am not. I was never. This is never going to be the case. You can build up, I don't know thousand more prototypes one ha one ha one thousand i don't know one thousand one million more it's never gonna be her absolutely never your girl was very unique everyone is very unique and that's okay you're still my angel you know the parents can't even grieve this way they are not accepting the death of their girl they can't ever grieve properly. They're always living in the past. And with a new self should come a new name, right? You know, I think I'll call you. There are the credits. I was waiting for this yesterday and I didn't see the credits. <laughs> Damn. <sighs> yeah, holy moly. I said this yesterday that how brilliant this I was about to say this movie. No, th this game was um But now we have the conclusion. I had so many theories. So many, and some of them were right. I really thought, I really thought there was an accident. And I, I don't know, I was, I was dying in the fire. My dad was trying to help me.
Yeah. My name is Mimi. <laughs> Are you the other Leon now? I am. I am myself. This game was absolutely brilliant with that. <laughs> I slowly. The player was slowly developing his subconscious. So funny with the name Enigma Machine as well. Congrats, dear Calf. I'm glad. I think I'll call you Credits. That's a pretty shitty <laughs> shit name, to be fair. <laughs> My name is Credits. What's yours? Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> this is such a gem. Um, it's such a gem. I had no idea it's going to be that good. I was so creeped at the beginning. But now it makes more sense. I still got the question. Not a question, but I, st I was never in the room of my brother. Maybe they didn't want to creep him out. Maybe they didn't want to, to scare him. I mean, he mentioned already they're doing this every week. That was already a hint, right? <laughs> I think the, the game developers... I don't know if there are many people behind... Oh, game by Jamie Gavin. I think this game, it, this game is just uh, heavily inspired by Black Mirror here. I, I love the topics. If people know me well... Um, they know that I love time traveling topic. I, I love talking about um, um, subconscious stuff, philosoph philosophical stuff, and um, that was such a good combination. I am I am celebrating this game so hard, actually, so so hard. Um, you rarely hear me talking like this. I am, yeah, I am. I kind of want to play this again to see. Um, what else mother is talking about i think with the third playthrough you, you're even understanding even more so it's, it's actually like uh, it was yeah it was sure not today thank you so much for this suggestion it was such a blast to play actually it was really really good um <laughs> i'm smiling so much here even though I, I mean now we finally have the good ending by by knowing what's going on but i it's still kind of open open end what's what's happening with us but now he knows that we are developing so far that I don't think he has another choice anymore. You can't replace a human being. You can't extract. I mean, e even in case, if I would be able to do that, I would not do it. I don't want to have a clone. I don't want to have my subconscious somewhere else living. <laughs> you need, you basically, you need to ask your, your future self or your copy, whatever. Hey, do you want to do that? How can I know this? Probably not. There is one episode. Um, there is one episode in Black Mirror. I don't know if some guys can remember. Oh, there were so many actually with uh, with this topic with subconscious. But um, one of my favorites is one. Uh, one of my favorites is actually uh, the one you are in the, on the spaceship, and this guy is collecting all the DNA of his uh, of the workers, and they are just copies. And they're living there forever and it's just oh it's such a but there's also the christmas episode oh my god there are so many actually it's super interesting i, I we need more episodes in black mirror actually <laughs> burbles um <laughs> can tell you're smiling it was an amazing game i was yeah i was scared of playing this game at the beginning it was also very creepy but luckily there are no jump scares not really um, it's the psychological horror behind. That episode is so trippy. Yeah, it, the end episode was also the longest one. I'm glad it was so long. It was so nice to read through the logs and look behind the scenes, basically. <laughs> Will this be uploaded to so I can re uh, rewatch the whole thing? Yes, of course. I'm always re-uploading. Of course. Uh, it's going to be available tomorrow, probably around 4. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, thank you so much again for the suggestion. It was it was a blast. Um, yeah, I love this game. I think it's one of my favorite games actually. If if you guys have more games like this, please let me know. Yeah, it's so good. It's so good. I love this topic. <laughs>